Hello everyone, my name is Cameron and welcome back to the Subnautica Let's Play. Today, we are going to, I think, get to the lava facility where we have to actually go get the Sea Dragon Emperor at. But first, we have to make a small detour. Um, so we actually need to go this way, I believe. Wait, hold up. Wait, which biome are we in right now? See, this is the problem I have, is you can't tell which biome you're in 90% of the time. So give me a second. I actually have this bi the biomes lo loaded up on my uh, phone real quick, so I can try to figure out which biome we're currently in. Um, which one are we in right now? Okay, so there's the bone fields. Let's see, corridor. Okay, are we in the... Are we in the bone fields? Okay, hold up. Are we in the bone fields? Where's the gargantuan fossil? Is it in here? If the gargantuan leviathan fossil is in here, we're in the bone fields. Which... Okay. That was terrifying. Okay, it does in fact look like... That is the gargantuan fossil, as far as I can tell. I don't know for sure. Give me a minute. Let me look at the picture. It's not. Okay. Okay. Okay, it looks like I'm in the tree... Tree cove. I'm assuming. Based off of this this skeleton here. Which means I believe I need to head east to go where we need to go. Fuck off, you little shit. You don't want to fight? I'll fuck this dude. Okay. I believe that means we need to head east from here. Right? Am I not where I think I am? Hold up. Maybe I'm in the ghost forest or the ghost canyon. Silver. This is the problem I have, is you have no idea what biome you're in right now. Like, I legit have no clue where I'm at, guys. But yeah, we, we are going to try to find the disease research facility, which means we need to get to a specific biome first, head east from that biome, and then keep heading east and we'll get to the disease research facility, basically. So basically what will happen is, we'll get into the biome I need to get into, we'll head east from that biome, it'll bring us into the junction, and then from that biome, we head east as well, which I believe this is the junction, because that is the sea moth skull, or the, not sea moth, the sea dragon um, skeleton. Which I believe is part of what's in this biome. Yes. So this is ha this has the sea dragon leviathan skeleton. So then we need to go to the east to go find the biome we're looking for. So we gotta go this way. Which I'm gonna assume is basically right here, because that looks like a precursor alien technology building type thing. So we're gonna we're gonna make sure we go this way. Yeah, look, we can we can definitely make sure. We're definitely going the right way. Like, there's no way we're not going the right way if it looks like that. There's some quartz. Oh shit, you know what I just thought about? Do I need a purple tablet to get into this, or is this one not? Give me a sec, guys.
Okay, so I do in fact need a purple tablet for this, but I do also believe that you can find a purple tablet here. I might be wrong on that, but I think you can. Can I actually find a purple tablet here? <clears throat> Fuck. Okay. So, I cannot find a purple tablet. I do need to get the purple tablet from here. Yes, I can in fact see that PDA. So, the question is, do I need the purple tablet? Question is, do I actually need the purple tablet to get the trophy for this? Because if so, I'm fucked. And I'll have to do this again in the next episode. Which sucks, because I really don't want to. I'm trying to find the entrance. If you guys don't know, this one's completely underwater. There's nothing... Like, none of this is air at all. It's all complete water. I think there's actually... Is there bits of it? I thought there was bits of it up there, but I could be wrong. I thought there was bits up on the shelf, but I might be wrong about that. I still don't see any way into here, though. So it might be... I might need to go higher up and see if I find more pieces to said facilitate. So I thought when I looked it up to figure this out, it said there was more, it, like the picture made it look like there was a bit here and then there's like a bit up on the shelf of like one of these areas. Give me a sec. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I really wish I would have fucking grabbed a purple tablet before I left now. Fuck. Um, because there's not much I can do now at this point. I mean, I'm pretty sure my last save point was still back at my base after I got all my food stuff and re ready to go. But I don't know if I want to reload and have to run all the way back here. Oh my god, where's the entrance to this fucking place? Oh, I hear a warper. Yeah, he won't touch me if I keep moving. Or at least he shouldn't. They don't tend to shoot you if you keep trying to get away from him. I think we're gonna have to- I think I'm gonna have to reload and get back here. God damn it. Oh, I really don't want to have to do that, because I really don't feel like wasting more time running back to this place. But, I really want to get inside this place. Because there, there is lore information inside of here. So, it would be nice to get. The problem is, I still don't know how to get inside of the place. Fucking douche. That's the problem, is I want to figure out how to get inside first. Before I... Go back to get the tablet. Because if I get the tablet, but still don't know how to get inside of here, it's kind of fucking pointless for me, you know what I mean? Alright, so how do I get inside this place? Because, I mean, clearly, the fact that the trophy hasn't popped up yet means I still haven't gotten... It found, apparently. Or else it'd be here already. I'd already have the trophy. I also think I'm going to grab a few more power cells before I come back. So that's the other thing I want to do. 
So let me see how to get inside this place because there's obviously a way to get into it. Okay. I killed it. It's northeast face. So that means this one. Near the top it said. Should be where the entrance is at. Okay, so it's right here. Okay, so the good news is we found where it's at, so. 12 minutes since my last save. So we're gonna let this, we're gonna do this, we're gonna reload, which is dumb, I know, but it's the easiest way to do this, because I'm not running all the way back there, and all the way back to my base, getting what I need, and then running all the way back again. That's just asinine to me, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back to the base like this, which is, I know, a little bit cheaty, but whatever. I should only need the one purple tablet to open this, so I should be fine. But yeah. We gotta wait for this shit to load through. Alright, so I looked it up. The only way to get the, Deca the Degasi stuff without going into a different save is to literally clear the cache for the game, which I'm not going to fucking do. I don't really trust doing the clear cache thing sometimes. It feels like it's always going to fucking me over. Again, I'm in the I know I'm in the Cyclops with, with this save. I don't know why it always tells me oxygen production is offline when I'm in the fucking Cyclops. Like, it's not going to power down. This game is dubbed so tight. And of course, the last time they updated the game was in December 2020. And they so they still haven't seen the issue of the PDAs not spawning in, which here's the thing, it's not like I'm the only person who's dealt with this. Other people have had dealt with the interactive objects and they're not spawning in, which is kind of the biggest issue. Is it's like if you know other people are facing this and it's not just one person, fix the issue, please. <laughs> Because it's a pain in the ass when developers don't want to listen to the people that play their game. Okay. All systems are welcome aboard. Oh my god, then come on. Stay plugged in. Alright. So we need what was it, an ion cube and two demondes, I believe. Oh, there's the ion cube. I think all my diamonds are around the Cyclops, which is perfect because I gotta go there anyway to grab the um, power cells. Nothing there. There's magnetite. God damn it. Oh, there's one. Up 
we go. I wish you could just make the uh, better power cell with like a normal power cell, like just combine a normal power cell with like ion cubes or some shit. Some sort of alternative recipe for it. Are you fucking kidding me? Do I really not have one more diamond? Oh, I'm gonna lose my mind if I don't. Oh, this is not good. We're gonna take that out. We're gonna take that out. Uh, we'll leave that one. And we'll take that one. There we go. Three more power cells in case my prawn suit needs it. Because I was using the first one, and as you guys probably saw, it was draining a lot quicker than I expected it to. So I'm gonna make sure that I don't lose power in this while I'm down there, because that's gonna really suck if I do. The amount of times this game's had to crash and reload, you'd think, just maybe, that it'd be updated to fix, that, that, that there'd be a fix for this. You know, that it'd fix the Degasi stuff not spawning in. But it doesn't. Because every time it's crashed, I've gone down there and checked. I'm not going to do it this time. I didn't do it. I don't think I did it the last time, but I'm not going to do it because it's not helping. It's not changing anything. It's still not there, so it doesn't really matter to me. It just, I wish it would fucking load in so I don't have this issue anymore. Game, if I don't have another fucking diamond in here, I'm gonna. Oh my fucking god, are you kidding me? Oh my god, this fucking game. Destroyed base, still needs power, still needs a thing to actually get into it. Uh oh. That's not good. Give me a quick second, guys. Are you fucking kidding me? This controller's dead too? God, fucking piece of shit. Stupid fucking PS4 stuff. Give me a sec, guys. I don't like this controller anyway, so... good news is I still have the type of charger this takes in my house so oh, god damn it okay so I'm gonna go take the prawn suit and go find diamonds now which is great oh, if I would have remembered to fucking check to see if it needed a goddamn I wish I would have checked man I really wish I would have checked so I should have realized it was gonna need something to power it up so it's kind of my own fault. So where can I find diamonds? Can I find diamonds down in the jelly shroom caves? I can't remember. All right, well, when in doubt, to the Gamepedia I go. I'm not gonna go down there just in case. Or apparently the game's gonna try to fucking make me go down there. Okay, they're found down here. Good, 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 good. That was the one thing we want to test, was make sure that diamonds were fucking spawnable down here before I went down there. I know they're in different areas, but I figured, fuck it, I'll go for this area. Just because it's right near my base, it doesn't take me a lot of time to get in here. It doesn't take me a lot of time to get out of here, so... That's a shell out crop. If I'm lucky, this gives me a diamond. Lithium. Okay. Well, that's not too bad to get. I will never complain about getting lithium. I mean, I have a shit ton of it now, but still. Look, game, I appreciate the lithium you're giving me, but... You know, it'd be a lot nicer if I could just get a diamond real quick. Stupid fucking sand shark. 
We'll take that gold, actually. Come get me, Sand Shark. Oh, wait, you can't because you're stupid and you got stuck. There's Magnetite. I mean, again, it's cool and all them getting them finding this stuff, but like. Game. I really need some diamonds. It'd be nice if they had them in that sort of fucking spawn, but they don't, so. Just more magnetite. I wonder if I could just spawn in the stuff for the Degasi base that I can't, that, that won't fucking work properly. Can I just spawn that in and get it? Or like, do I legitimately have to find, like, is that spawnable? As if it is, I might just spawn it in. <sighs> Damn it, I wish I knew. This is not what I expect to be doing right now. Don't expect that to come down here. Find a fucking diamond. The fuck? Can I actually step on that? No, okay, it's just a glitch. There we go, finally. And for those of you wondering, did I maybe just miss one of the PDAs somewhere? No, like legitimately, the PDAs, I've gotten them all down here that I can get right now. Um, there's supposed to be a table in that last base with a PDA on it, and it's just not spawning in. The table and the PDA just aren't spawning in, and I don't know why. I don't know if it's because the game's glitching out when it's loading, or if the game just wants to be extra fucking stupid, or what's going on, but that base is not working properly. I cannot actually get what I'm supposed to be getting from it, which is annoying as hell. Because it's not even like it has the biggest impact on the main story. I just wanted to figure out the whole story of that. Because I thought it'd be kind of cool to know. But the game obviously decided that instead of actually spawning it in and letting me get the rest of the story, it was going to be like, you know, we could do that, but instead we're just going to say fuck you and not fix the issue. There's my way out. Nope, I need to let my tr jump... Jet recharge. So let me land over here. So I don't have to go higher up. Let me recharge it a little bit. Get up to the first outcropping right here. Wait a minute. Jump off and uh, go up. And this should get me the rest of the way out so I can travel back to my base and go make this. Fucking stupid purple tablet, man. I wasn't thinking about this. I should have been. I should have looked to make sure and see if I needed it. We're, so we're just going to do this the easy way. We're going to go... Actually, you know what? Never mind. The easier way is going to be going through my base, actually, because it's... I'm going... I, I took the, a different way to get there last time. I went this way. I went around like this instead of the way I normally take. So that's just what we're going to do again. So we're going to quickly hop up here. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? Why don't you guys remind me that I need to grab it out of the fucking storage? What the hell? Two, because we don't need those on us, so we're just going to put them up here. Okay. Boom. Oh, boom. What do I need for the orange tablet again? Nickel. Okay, that's right. Why does the orange tablet need nickel? Is it because it's only got the one spot it's supposed to go to? Even though nickel is a lot harder for me to get than diamond. Whatever. Alright. Also, do you guys notice how that one... That was weird. The other day, that... Or, uh, that wasn't spawning in. The... the supports for the Seamoth one didn't spawn in. I don't think the supports for this one even spawned in. Oh, this game is a laggy mess and I love it.
Actually, just to be safe, I'm gonna save it real quick. Just in case the game decides it wants to be an asshole. We'll, we'll save it. So we're gonna sit here for a minute. Um, the episode's almost over, so again, I'll probably end up traveling there without you guys watching. Just to make it a little bit easier for you guys and waste less time. And then, uh, yeah. Slowly wait for the game to not be an asshole. Come on. Why? This is the other thing I hate is it takes so long for this game to save. And I don't know why. It's so aggravating. I should probably put that controller on the charger. I should probably put all my PS4 controllers on, char on the charger, actually, to be honest. Get them all, get them all nice and charged up. And I really only use the one, which is why it's always dead. But the other three, or four, sorry, I have four of them. I have the white one that I got with it, a red, a blue, and then a gray one. All four of those ones are really fucking terrible. They all have something wrong with them. I want to send them all in. I want to get them all cleaned up and then send them in to get repaired so they can figure out what the issue is. But I also don't have the money to do that right now, so. All right, so let's head out the area we need to go to um, start heading over there we might make it we might make it before the episode ends we might make it there and then I'll just head to the disease research facility on my own and then come back pick up with you guys and uh, let you guys see me explore that place for the first time I didn't even realize like how close because I've been close to it obviously we've been down there so much in the past few episodes had i just brought purple tablets with me the one day i would have done been done with that area already i would have had it done brought three purple tablets if i would have used my brain and remembered about the disease research facility in the first place also apparently every area is supposed to be able for the cyclops to get to it i don't think this area is able for the cyclops to get there i don't know for sure but it seems like it's not able to be just personally, in my opinion, it seems like it's not able to be, but whatever. Um, so yeah, it's just, I don't know. I definitely, when I play modded, I can't, I can't wait to play modded on this because there's a lot of mods that I'm really looking forward to. I don't know if I'm going to add the Gargantuan Leviathan in because I'm a, I'm a bitch. Uh, I will do the de-extinction mod though because that looks pretty cool. And then probably some of the, the mods that add in some weapons and stuff just to see what the game's like with weapons because that sounds like a fun idea. God, every time I have to run here, I hate it so much more. But yeah, like I said, I don't even think I can actually get through this area with with uh, the Cyclops. At least it doesn't seem like it can be done to me. Like, it's really stupid that it says the Cyclops can get to the inactive lava zone through every single entrance. Like, I can't get through this area with the Cyclops. So that makes that seem like it's a fucking lie to me. Although maybe I'm just dumb and I went through it. Because I think if I went a different way, taking also has a way to the inactive lava zone. I think if I had taken this way and gone to it, I would have made it. No problem. Because this, this is open enough and big enough for you to use the Cyclops through it. Like, this is a nice large cavern. It almost actually looks like you're going into like the stomach of the Gargantuan Leviathan or something. But yeah, this is large enough for you to get the Cyclops through. I've proved that point already. It's getting further in. That's the problem. But that's going to do it for this episode, you guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'll see you all in the next one. Stay golden. Peace.